Hey, I'm Andrew. I'm building a 12 and a half meter catamaran and I wanted to take a little bit of longer time to walk you through how I built sort of the fore deck and the whole front of the bridge deck area. Um, so yeah, I'll show you how I did that. The first step was basically to build all the panels. So they're all, as you probably have seen, composite panels. So they have a PVC foam core and then layers of fiberglass on the outside. So that makes for like a really strong um, and light structure. So the first step was to vacuum, uh, to basically build all those panels. So put out all the cloth, cloth with resin and then put them all together in a vacuum. And the next bit was to assemble them all on the boat. So you can see here we have this like big diagonal panel here. This was actually in two parts, which I then decored uh, and joined. So you decor both the panels and then you uh, switch them together with a new core and take an epoxy and then you add fiberglass to the outside. Um, and then inside there's more triangle supports. And then of course, occasionally there's mistakes. So actually when I was measuring with my laser measure device, I had it set in the wrong setting. And so I ended up with a little gap here that I had to fill uh, with an extra little wedge that I just glued in place. And so this is gonna get a nice big fillet and then also more glass on the outside. So, so lots of reinforcing to go, but it's all covered up for now, which is nice. So yeah, the next step basically after building all the panels was to join them together. So this was one big area and I built it, I had the vacuum pump at home. So to bring it, these panels to the bug yard, I had to bring them in multiple pieces. So I had to join these all together. You can see it's um, five pieces all in all uh, to span, um, span this big four deck area. Um, so basically like I also did the decoring and then joining together with uh, thick and epoxy and a fiberglass on each side. Um, and then these, these um, had to be, these edge pieces were a little bit more of a complex shape. So basically what I did was I joined these three panels together in the middle um, and then I sort of laid them in place uh, in the middle and then I added these two panels um, on top and I traced out how the shape should be and then I took them down and I cut them out. Um, so they would fit exactly, pretty much exactly well. There's a little bit of a gap, which is what I want because I want to be able to fill it with thick and epoxy and then uh, fiberglass on both sides. So it's nice and strong. And yeah, it looks like kind of really big flat area right now and I think it looks a little bit odd um, but with the when the tablet when the cabin top comes over the top of it um, it'll break up the big flat area a little bit and I think it'll look a little bit nicer <laughs> so yeah no of course uh, my brother was here for a little while uh, he helped out and then of course I have my lovely wife uh, she also is always helping out um, doing the layups um, she comes here in the boatyard and helps cut out the pieces and does tabbing and glassing so that's really nice as well it's a team effort always that was basically an overview from the outside, but now I can show you from the inside what it all looks like and all the reinforcements and that kind of stuff. This is basically the area. So before, you maybe saw my last video, this was all um, uncovered. So now it's covered, which is nice. And so this is the, the, the night area where the, where the beds are. So this is where this is where we'll sleep on each side. And uh, actually the bed will come out to like about here or so. So it'll be two meters long, 140 centimeters wide. Um, yeah, basically what I've done here um, is to align all the panels. I've just basically added some temporary blocking, which is screwed in, which just keeps these panels aligned with the, with the other ones. Um, and so next will be basically just adding the thickened epoxy in the middle and then um, fiberglass on both sides. Um, so yeah, there's um, a lot of structure that was added here. So there's these bulkheads. These are these um, longitudinal bulkheads, which will really help support you know your weight when you're walking on the deck, but also the mast, because the mast will be... Uh, up forward in this area and then if we come a little bit more forward um, you can see there's this sort of bridge deck chamfer area so there's the diagonal panel which sort of helps um, this diagonal panel here helps tie up the front of the bridge, bridge deck together um, so you can see we have four of these uh, um, kind of triangular supports which just help hold that panel in place and also help um, support your weight when you're walking on it so we had four of those um, which you saw me and my friends and partner Lame all in. And uh, yeah, so a little bit, a lot of more structure and stiffness added to the boat, um, but still a long way to go. As you can see, there's still a lot more to do. There's this whole cabin top area, which we still haven't built at all yet. Um, there's lots of benches and supports, lots of extra structure inside. There's like a longitudinal bulkheads and, and a unidirectional cloth and lots of more reinforcement to add. Um, so yeah, I'm just getting started here on YouTube and so I'm going to be documenting it a lot more. So if you want to learn more about how I do this, um, follow along, you can subscribe, uh, give the video a like and uh, yeah, we'll keep uh, throwing the crew and we'll keep uh, building away. And uh, if you have any questions or things that you'd like to see more in a video or things you'd like me to address or just anything that you have on your mind, yeah, leave a comment and uh, I'll try to answer it or maybe I'll shoot a video about it as well. And, uh, this is an expensive project. Uh, I quit my job in order to start working on it full time. It's really eating away into my savings. 
So if, if you'd like, uh, it's optional, but if you'd like, uh, there's a link to my Patreon in the description below as well. Um, and there I'm going to be adding a little bit more technical uh, documentation. How did I calculate like what size of the panels and how much reinforcement all the panels need to have um, and all that kind of stuff. Um, so if you're interested in that side of things, uh, check out Patreon.